What's up everyone, my name is Brett, sometimes I wear a beret, and I have something to show you that you've probably already seen before on my channel and other places. The Nerf Grenade, the T238 NLDT. I can never remember that name, but luckily it's printed right on the side. Yeah, I reviewed this before. This one was sent to me by NF Strike, and it is interesting. I've put this through some testing paces for sure. By this point, there are some parts chipped off, but ultimately it still functions exactly how it should. When this piece comes loose, okay ow <laughs> it does that the flaps extend and whatever's inside is launched originally comes with gel balls but we like using rival rounds or nerf darts and so let's mix it up a bit this is the clear version that is now being sold this one was also sent to me for free by nfstrike.com thank you very much and it really is just the same as the original of course one is clear one is not it says uh, one other difference too. This one does say T238 and LDT. This one just says T238. Don't think that's very different though. You can also see anything you put inside. So that's nice. I know right now that this is closed and there are rival rounds inside. So that when I drop it, shoot, I'm not getting those back. So that when I drop it and it opens up, everything explodes as I would imagine. One of these, is a little stiff and gets stuck sometimes. I don't know if that's just my model or it is a problem with these springs, but it seems pretty reliable overall. And when it's released from rest or when it's released from its maximum potential, it is fine, but sometimes halfway, not so much. But again, you're not really gonna have that situation. And yeah, this also comes with the uh, key ring that will stop it from being shifted around and opened and there it goes <laughs> so there really isn't too much to say about this new uh, nf strike grenade perhaps other than one is clear and one is black and orange so what are my opinions on it then it's great to have a clear option but it's also kind of a curse we've definitely been having a lot more clear blasters show up which is really cool to see what's inside but these grenades are kind of iffy People already wonder if we should be using them in games, and for those who do allow them, they have some strict limitations. That versus just using them indoors, it's understandable. You do not want to get hit still by this chunk of plastic. Dropping this on a nice leafy ground is probably fine. The problem though with a clear throwable, or underhandable, I suppose, this is gonna get dirty. I'm okay with this other one getting scratched up a bit and getting full of leaves, because it's uh, it's black and orange, it looks like it's meant to take wear. I, I like this one to be nice and pristine, but that's up to you, I suppose. You could definitely dye this one and make it a different color. That'd be kind of neat. I guess the choice is ultimately up to you. Since I haven't actually tested the power of this, that this would have upon hitting someone, I'm going to do that today so that you can know whether or not you actually want to use these in a game. Uh, and I'm going to take the hit, and let's see how that goes. We're going to be doing tests. I do not recommend you do them at home, that's why I'm doing them here. And I'm using Chelo's mask because it's the best. Oh, wasn't that bad? <laughs> <laughs> I like the mask. <laughs> so that's a tennis ball, dog tennis ball launcher thing. <laughs> that one was a little harder. And that's the grenade for you. A lot of fun, doesn't matter what color it is, black and orange, or the clear version. If you're interested in picking this up, I'll put a link in the description box down below. Hopefully I've shown you the safety you'd want to practice when using these. Be careful with your friends, be careful at a game, just be careful with this product in general. You can have a lot of fun, but don't throw this at each other's faces. 
If you want to see my original review on it with Out of Darts, I'll include that in the description box below as well. Thank you everyone for watching. I'll see you later.